Are your pets inside? Tonight, Animal Care Services is checking on pets that people left outside in this bitter cold. Cats and dogs susceptible to frostbite and hypothermia, just like humans. Just like us, the night team's Patty Santos tells us why Animal Care Services has been trying to educate the community ahead of the freeze. Anyone who's been out tonight knows just how cold it is outside. Sadly, Animal Control Services says some pets, they're going to be left outside tonight. Hello? Animal Care? Animal Care Service Officer Stephanie Champa went nearly door to door here in this west side block. Because it's about to get really cold. Trying to make sure these dogs aren't left in the cold. We're just going around trying uh, to educate the public in regards to the cold that's coming in. Does in just one block, she stopped at four houses to make sure the dogs she noticed would be okay. She can't stay in there, especially no, no. with the weather that's yeah, coming up. Yeah, she says cool. most pet owners just need a reminder. Sometimes they don't really know um, in regards to what is the proper care for their animals. You know, they'll love their animals and stuff, but they're like, oh, I didn't realize that my dog needed a dog house while it's outside. <laughs> ACS says pets should be brought indoors. Those left outdoors cannot be tied up and must have a shelter with blankets plus food and water. I mean, if you're cold, they're most likely cold. The same rule applies for any other type of pet left outside like cats or rabbits. ACS expects an influx of calls to check on pets left outside. You're not in trouble or anything? Chapa says she wants the community to remain vigilant and help each other out. Well, we don't want to take anyone's animals. We want to make sure that they stay at home. But a home that's warm and safe. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News.